Hi everybody, this is Chris Marks, Africa Connect Online. Today I'm here in Jobek, summer cup lunch, and I'm with Kabero. I'm with the champion here. <laughs> I'm not gonna mention <laughs> the other brand, but he's a champion. Should we mention it? Oh, I can. <laughs> uh, yes, um, I've, I've won the Devon July, so yeah, you can say it, it's one of the races that will make you be considered one of the South African best jockeys if not the, yeah. the champion I would say I'm a champion in making but not yet the, the champion of South Africa but in the making what do you mean not yet the champion of SA after winning the in July well as much as you can win the Devon July but um, the, the, the championship is not only based on that yeah. but it's based on your overall performance how oh. many winners you have you ridden in the season and how well you've done so yeah I mean I finished in the top 10 of the South African jockey's log. So, as I said, I'm slowly climbing the ladder and hopefully in the next two years' time, I'll, I'll be the one leading the log. It's two years' time. We've got the Summer Cup on the 25th of November. Preparations, how, how are they going? Well, I'll say the preps for, for, for on my side, they've on, all go, gone well. Um, Mao said it's first prep run here in Joburg uh, on, on the charity mile. And he ran a, a very impressive race after winning the Holy Best in July coming here to Afrintin first time and to run fourth getting beats under length by yeah. the defending Summer Cup horse. So looking at that and looking at, looking at the margins, knowing that going in that race that was uh, a prep run for me and it makes me more confident going to the Summer Cup. Yeah, is this your first or how many? Um, I think I've ridden in two or three Summer Cups, not sure. And but how many did you win? Well, I haven't won a Summer Cup yet, okay. but um, hopefully this year is the first time winning. If you win this one. Yeah. Well, <laughs> what, when what I win, mean? not if, when I when. win. When? I like that. I like yeah. that. <laughs> yeah. Like the importance of this one compared it's, to others. What's, well, what's special? It, it's, it, it's become more special now. I mean, yes, it's the biggest race we have in the high field. Yeah. And now it being in the same category in the same division with the yeah. hollywood best step in july in terms of stakes it, it's just it's a big uh step up in 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 our race um and you know with uh when you look at the the day itself it, yeah. it's such a big day and it deserves to have a race of that stature yeah. and to have that that publicity and I mean, it's nice to see that there's a, there's a lot of sponsorships that have um, came through to to be part of the, the partnership. Yeah. That way has put in a lot of money in the game and they've helped us in a lot of ways. And they're supporting not just only the race itself, but the people involved in the in the race itself, like the grooms getting yeah. incentives. And even with, I say, South African Airways being part of the the day it's, it's it's a huge thing so yeah the day itself the race it's it's, an, it's a very important race yeah. and i would say in the next two years five years time if it stays like this or if it even gets better than this it'll be in the same league as the as the hollywood best day in july oh, which nice. is i mean it's already there yes you you spoke a lot about the sponsors i'm not gonna ask any question you've said a lot <laughs> all i want to know now how much are you really guys <laughs> <laughs> well um as, as much as the, the stake price is 5 million rands, yeah. there's, there's a lot of deductions that happen in that race. Um, being a big race, it, it, it's split into 10 positions in okay. the race, so first 10 places in a oh, race, it's divided into those. Um, I think for first place, it will probably be something around 2.9 million, and in that 2.9 million, um, 90% goes to trainer and owner and then 10% comes to the jockey so I mean with all the, the splits it's still good money and um, it leaves everyone very happy you're, you're more detailed <laughs> it, we, we hardly get uh, people like you who are more details, detailed when it comes to their winnings thank you so much for that and um, for young people out there who wants to be like you man like what, what does it take well yeah you know when you speak about being detailed um that's one thing that you as a youngster as someone yeah. that is trying to make something of their lives you need to pay attention to detail and sometimes you, you shouldn't just do things for the sake of doing them yeah. um do something to to perfect it if not master it and just keep working hard keep your head down and whatever opportunity that comes your way 
just grab it with both hands and, and just run with it. And also the most important thing, never lose focus. Um, it, whenever you, you, you're growing up in life and you getting better, especially when you, you're doing well in your career or whatever department you, you might be in, there would be a lot of there will be a lot of distractions yeah. um, where you feel like you know some people hit the comfort zone and they think that they've made it in life, but you just have to keep pushing. Um, there's there's never an end yeah. in pushing. You never get you never improve by just being stagnant and being in yes. one position. You need to always push yourself to be better than yourself the day before. Never compete with other people. Just compete with yourself. Always improve on yourself and always allow yourself to, to actually learn more and open yourself to more opportunities. Don't just think that you've mastered one thing and that's the only that's thing that you need to know. But just keep growing yourself. And I mean, there's a lot of opportunities out there. As much as, yes, South Africa is tough, uh, employment rate is high and all that stuff. But if you open up yourself to opportunities, I mean, if you look at the sports of horse racing, yeah. uh, th there's there's a lot of opportunities in racing, and for us youngsters, it's, it's good for us to also be part of the sports and be part of this important sport. Uh, it's as much as it's got its risks, but if you put your mind into it, you can do anything you want. You know what? We can't wait to see you <laughs> on the 25th of November. Thank you so much, man, for your time. Um, where can we catch you? <laughs> social well, media? Social media. I'm there. Instagram, Facebook. You'll find me there. LinkedIn. Matsunyane Cabello. Yeah. No, this is Chris Marks with Cabello. Guys, we'll catch you again on Africa Connect Online. That's the only platform you can get me. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. Cheers. Sure.